Stealing your wife's fish. I'm not going hungry. <laughs> <laughs> This morning, Jeff, Atlas, and I are eating a quick breakfast before we have playtime with the new pups. Once Atlas goes down for a nap, we'll do some ATV training with the dogs. Take like a ball. Come on. Hey, what noise does a dog make? <laughs> woof woof. Bah. Yeah, they like to play with balls too. Look. Huh, bub? <laughs> no, no, no. Well, put these puppies back with mama. Get Atlas down for a nap. All right. Can I hold all of them? Yeah. Can we get a picture? Yeah. Oh! oh. <laughs> Don't try this at home. <laughs> it's dog training weather, huh? All right, we'll attach that one on the house to this one. Two, four, six. Bonnie, Clyde, Tom. Johnny's a seven. Our cute little chicks have grown into fully adult chickens. Today is the day we harvest the chicken meat. <laughs> Rooster trying to get me. Rooster's pissed. beautiful Valdez port this morning. Our friend Tom is taking us out on his boat to fish for some cod. Oh, gaining ground, I can tell. Oh, it's a cod. That's a fat cod All too. Right. First catch, hon. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> Woohoo! All right, there's dinner. <laughs> Chuck him in the box. I'm getting this friend. I don't know what you got going on in that spot right there. No. They rob another one. It's on. It's you're gonna get a ganyan hook. It's a ganyan hook. Sounds dangerous. <laughs> I want one. I'm pretty strong too. <laughs> Stealing your wife's fish. I'm not going hungry. <laughs> Game ground. Oh, another big fat cod. All right, that feels about the, the size of. <laughs> Was fighting. Got a big chunk a bit out of her. I know something took a whack. Dang, something really took a whack <laughs> out of that. <laughs> you were a fighter. Yeah, she was. <laughs> Beating you. Sound two right off my hooks. Back at the homestead, we're prepping a delicious dinner with salad from our garden and salmon from the Copper River. I was thinking about when I first went out to, to bait the bears. Mm -hmm. When I went out there with the ca canoe, the water was so high, the river was freaking ripping. Yeah. It was scary. <laughs> I couldn't stop the canoe. If I hit something right now, the canoe's probably gonna break. But, Frozen Trident and Kennel is a place where we see how many irons we can put in the fire without getting burnt. <laughs> we have various goals, ambitions, and I think there's a misconception whenever you have a kennel of 30 dogs that you just look at them as a herd of livestock, and that's not how I feel about it at all. Yeah, go on. 
we really take pride in how we individualize our dogs. I didn't forget about you, Lo. Really cool just to be able to spend your whole day learning about your dogs, what makes them tick, learning their inner personalities. We also always try to live our lives in accordance with our values. Following through with your word, if you say family comes first, put your family first. Can you go see your puppies? If you say kindness and compassion is most important, be kind, be compassionate. It's always a work in progress and that's always what we're trying to do. I had actually come up here for this rotation to prove Jeff wrong. I was like, I'm gonna go up to Alaska. I know you really wanna move there. But I was honestly hoping that I would hate it because it was so far out of my comfort zone. But instead, Alaska captured my soul. The rest is history.